The girls lacrosse playoffs continue in the sectional quarterfinal round. The Valley is the three seed in playing host for this matchup with the six seed Geneva. The Valley knocked off the Vikings earlier this month by a score of 16-6. The Valley with an early 1-0 lead. Geneva looking to even things up off the reset, but Bella Kerr makes the save at point-blank range and sends the ball the other way. A few minutes later, the Valley is able to add on to the lead as Kelly Kliss drives left and scores on the bouncer. A nifty goal as it's now a 2-0 advantage in favor of the home team. As the first half winds down, Sophia Morgan patiently waits for her chance before breaking towards the net and adding on another goal. The Valley goes up 3-0. Just before halftime, Marley Haynes makes a spin pass to Geneva defender and fires a pass to Milena Williamson who scores to put her team up 4-0 at the break. About 10 minutes into the second half, Geneva gets on the board for the first time. Sarah Brandstad passes from behind the goal to Samantha Kressler as the Vikings get on the board with a one-timer. A little over a minute later, Kressler makes a high arching pass to Olivia Holmes who catches and fires to cut the lead in half. Geneva trailing just 4-2 with 15 minutes remaining. Sophia Morgan looking to help the Valley extend the lead with an attempt off a reset, but goalie Alyssa Borowski makes the stop to give her team a chance. Geneva in search of another goal as Madeline Diamond comes from behind the net, but Bella Kerr makes a big stop of her own to keep it a two-goal game. Under three minutes left, the Valley trying to hang on. Kressler once again finds Holmes and the Vikings have battled back and now trail just 4-3 in the final minutes. Geneva regains possession in the final 15 seconds, scrambling to get a shot as the clock winds down. Emily Shield and Delaney Bannock put the pressure on, just trying to run out the clock by keeping the ball on the turf. Milena Williamson charges in to help knock the ball loose as the clock finally runs out. The Valley hangs on to win a thriller over Geneva. St. Charles East awaits in the sectional semifinals. I think we started out really strong. That's like how I think we got our lead is we just started really strong. We had a lot of energy off the bat. And especially since it's really hot, we just had a lot of energy off the bat. And we fell off a little bit in the second half, but um, we kept at it. And I think we just we had short spurts of intensity that really helped us out. I think that we really hustled the first half. Um, second half, we were getting a little hot. We were getting a little... I would say out hustled. Um, we haven't played a game in a week, so I think that kind of like set us off a little bit. But I think we did come out strong in the end, and we fought through the heat, and we played pretty well. Yeah, definitely. I think it's just um, we just really want to win. It's a playoff game. I want to keep the season going. So I think with that in the back of my mind, the fact that the score was very low, like it just kept me going. A lot of times we're forcing the goal. Um, most of the time it goes in, but it's kind of a 50-50, so you want to take the opportunities to take the goal as well as settle it down, especially if the middies are running all the way back and forth. It's kind of nice to save the middies' legs a little bit because it is really hot and it's difficult. Um, but I think we did a nice job of settling, getting it around, um, making sure everyone gets a touch at it, um, always forcing, but if it's not there, it's not there, so pulling out is nice.